A leading newspaper of Pakistan, the Daily Express Tribune, has praised its neighbour and for India and also its Prime Minister Narendra Modi. An article published in the newspaper said, Modi may be a despised name in Pakistan, but he has done something to brand India which none before him was able to manage. This editorial has been written by Shahzad Chaudhary, who is a renowned political security and defence analyst. Chaudhary writes, Russia is under American sanctions and none can trade freely with Russia except India, which buys Russian oil on preferred terms and then re-export it to help an old patron earn dollars the indirect way. Two opposing military superpowers of the world claim India to be its ally. If this isn't a diplomatic coup, what is? This might be a first for a Pakistani newspaper, praising India's global achievements and also acknowledging the Prime Minister's role in the growth of India as a global brand. He wrote, India jumped to 100 billion USD reserves in 2004 from measly 9.2 she had in 1992. Under Manmohan Singh, India increased the reserves to 252 billion USD by 2014. Under Modi, these have galloped to over 600 billion and the GDP is sized over 3 trillion USDs. This is monumental progress which makes India a preferred destination for all investors. He continues and makes a comparison and writes that India has fifth largest economy in the world, ahead of the UK. It is aimed to be the third largest economy in the world by 2037. It is fourth in FE reserves with over 600 billion USDs, while Pakistan currently holds 4.5 only. Shahzad also refers to the abrogation of the Article 370 in Kashmir. He writes, One hates to admit, but Pakistan was politically outmaneuvered by India and Kashmir by rescinding Article 370 of its constitution, which gave a special, if not disputed, status to the region. He brings spotlight onto India's changing world politics. He writes, the gap between Pakistan and India is now unbridgeable. India has broken free of the shackles that kept her tight in South Asia and hyphenated in global perception with Pakistan. Beginning with Rajiv Gandhi to Modi, there has been clear distancing of the Indian foreign policy away from Pakistan. That turns India more Asia than just South Asia and a cloud which is far expanding. After dwelling on India's G20 membership and reach in G7, the journalist asserts that it is time for Pakistan to recalibrate its policy towards India and to be bold enough to create a tri-nation consensus along with China. He ends with, or we may be reduced to footnote of history. Do tell us what you think about this video in the comment section and for more news updates, subscribe to India Today.